Hey guys! So I hope you're having a wonderful weekend and I have some October empties for you. I know I'm really really late on this but I have had uh, midterms like crazy. I finally finished my last midterm uh, yesterday so I'm done. Yay! <laughs> so uh, let's go ahead and get started. So I have not really very many um, but We'll just kind of weed through these. So the first thing I have is the Dial Body Wash. This is in um, Spring Water. I really like this actually. I don't know if you can, you'll be able to see that, but uh, I really do like this. It um, the scent is very. It's not overpowering. Um, it's very fresh. So I really like that. Um, so this is a really great body wash. Um, I already have a backup, so yay. <laughs> but yeah, this this is a really good body wash. I actually have been using bar soap for forever just because I never really got into the whole body wash thing, but now I am so into it, so <laughs> love it. Uh, okay, and the next thing is um, my beloved hard candy face primer. I have finished this up. Just a side note, I'm sorry if if there's a glare right here. Uh, the, the sun is shining oddly, so sorry for that. Um, anyway, this is a really great primer. I really, really liked this. So I have finished this up and I am now using the Laura Geller, uh, I think it's Spackle. Um, I have a sample of that, so I'm using that up. But uh, no, this this is a really great primer. Um, if you want a very inexpensive primer um, that still gives you a flawless finish, so great primer. I have a mascara, and this is the L'Oreal of Luminous Lash Out Butterfly Mascara. I have a full review on this. I will link that down below so you can watch it. Um, I just in short, I was not a fan of this. Um, it did lengthen my lashes, but it just really didn't do much else for me. Um, the one that I'm using now that I've really been enjoying is the Makeup Forever uh, Smoky, Smoky Extravagant Mascara. This is a little sample size, um, but this is really, this is a nice mascara. So comparable to this, um, because this just, I just really didn't like this. So, um, but... Uh, I just use this up for the sake of using it up because <laughs> I don't like to have too many mascaras open at the same time so but so kind of a fail for me uh, then the next thing I have that's makeup related is the uh, Lorac behind the scenes eye primer um, I have a lot of these laying around so I finally finished this one up uh, and I also have a backup, um, but I really do like this primer. This is a really nice primer. Um, not only used for the Lorac shadows, but um, for other shadows too. This works really nice, so that's a good one. And then I have uh, the, I am using a different skincare system, and if you'd like to, uh, have a more in-depth video on these products then leave uh, a comment down below um, if you want to see uh, what I'm using uh, more in depth but this is the proactive plus system I really like this my skin is not flawless at all it has a lot of um, I have a lot of hyperpigmentation acne scarring uh, discoloration and really I do actually have a few breakouts that um, I still struggle through. Uh, but I recently have been using this over the past most definitely month um, and I love this. So what you're getting in here is you are getting the uh, Proactive Skin Smoothing Exfoliator which this is your wash that you use um, morning and night and I really, really like this. This is a great face wash. Um, there's no scent to it, but I really, really like this a lot. So 
Um, so you get that, and there is uh, two fluid ounces in this. So uh, for size wise, uh, and then the next thing that you get is the pore targeting treatment. This is really nice. Um, you put this on after, obviously, you washed your face, and then you apply this. Uh, basically where you have spots that you want to get rid of. Uh, spots meaning uh, acne that you want to get rid of. Um, this does a really great job. It has a, a pump here which I really like. Uh, but So you put this on morning and night as well uh, and it clears up my breakouts like none other. So this is nice. Really, really like that. Um, okay, and then the last thing that you get in this kit is the uh, Complexion Perfecting Hydrator. I love this. And what's ironic to me is I literally used up, I don't know if you'll be able to see that, literally used up every last bit of this stuff. I just love this. You wouldn't think somebody, especially me, I have oily skin, you wouldn't think oily skin people need a hydrator. That is a complete wives tale. You absolutely need a hydrator and this is awesome. This uh, I use under my makeup so after I've washed my face, applied the, um, the acne treatment, I put this on and it just makes my skin so nice so soft I just love this so again morning and night with this as well and I promise you you will see changes in your skin it's pretty darn amazing <laughs> so if you want to see um, my skincare routine uh, leave comments down below uh, requesting that and I will certainly do that for you okay and then the uh, last thing I have is the simple um, makeup remover wipes. These are the uh, Sensitive Skin Experts cl uh, Cleansing Facial Wipes. I love these. Um, they are just amazing. I hadn't used, um, I was using Purity, but I'm allergic to that. <laughs> surprise, surprise. Um, <laughs> and I was not using a makeup wipe um, for a very long time because number one, I uh, was allergic to a lot of them. Um, my skin is very, very sensitive and I just, um, the makeup wipes just weren't doing anything. I tried so many. I tried the Neutrogena ones, the CVS brand ones, and both of those burned my skin and just was not a good fit. Um, but these are amazing. I love these. I have several backups of these. Um, they are just awesome. Uh, they remove every trace of makeup that I have on my face and I, I just can't say enough good things about these. They're awesome. So that is it for my October empties. I hope you guys enjoy this. Thank you so, so much for watching. And if you want to see my uh, skincare routine with the Proactive Plus, please leave a comment down below. And I hope you have a wonderful day and a wonderful weekend, and I will talk to you very soon. Bye!